Honey has been known for thousands of years to be a superior health and beauty food. All their beneficial effects are attributed by vitamins, minerals, plant-based antioxidants, and their enzymes. So, what are enzymes? They're essential to life. We cannot digest and absorb any food that we eat without enzymes. Our body cells use enzymes to produce energy from our food. Without enzymes, we will have no energy to do anything, not even basic energy for the survival of our body. Enzymes make honey the nutritious and sweet superfood that we all know. There are usually more than 10 different enzymes inside honey. Most of them are made by the bees and then deposited into the honey. And one very highly tested enzyme inside honey is diastase. This enzyme is very unique and beneficial to us in three ways. Diastasis is also known as amylase. Its main function is to break down starch, the large carbohydrates, into small sugars that we can absorb. Our bodies need a lot of amylase because starch is a very big part of our diet. For example, rice, potato, wheat, corn, banana, oats, sago, and so on. When we take honey, these diastases help us digest our food better and reduce problems such as bloating. Now, pure honey may not always be of high quality. The International Honey Commission has recognised the enzyme diastase as a key standard for honey quality. Excess heating of honey damages a lot of its natural vitamins and antioxidants. Because diastase is heat sensitive, it would mean that honey with the presence of diastase was minimally processed and heated. Therefore, would most probably still contain most of its beneficial vitamins, antioxidants and other enzymes. Finally, the diastase level in honey tells you whether a honey is made by sugar-fed bees or flower bees. This is because research have found that sugar-fed bees produce honey that has very little diastase as compared to honey from nectar of flowers. Sugar-fed bees' honey would also have very low amounts of other enzymes and no plant-based components that provide the antioxidant benefits of honey. So, the next time you buy honey, be sure to ask for the honey's diastase activity. With that being said, do take note that some floral honeys may have naturally low levels of diastase. Now, in this case, other international standards may be applied to determine the quality of honey.